unraveling the phrase, chalk it up, a deep dive into English idioms. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel, where we explore the fascinating world of English language and idioms. Today, we're going to delve into a very interesting phrase, chalk it up. Understanding idioms like this is not just about learning English, but about immersing yourself in the culture and nuances of the language. So, let's get started. The phrase, chalk it up, is an idiomatic expression used in various contexts. Essentially, it means to attribute or ascribe something to a particular cause or source. It's often used when acknowledging or explaining the reason behind a particular outcome or situation. For instance, if someone says, I chalk it up to experience, they mean that they attribute whatever happened to their experience. It's a way of saying that they've learned something from the situation. Understanding the origin of chalk it up can help us grasp its meaning better. This idiom is believed to have originated from the old habit of writing accounts or scores on a chalkboard. In pubs or inns, bartenders would chalk up a customer's tab for drinks or food, adding to it as the customer ordered more. Hence, chalk it up became a metaphor for attributing or assigning something to a person's account or responsibility. Let's see how chalk it up is used in everyday language. Here are a few examples. After losing the game, the coach said, let's chalk it up to bad luck and try harder next time. When I asked why the project failed, my colleague responded, you can chalk it up to a lack of planning. In each of these cases, the speaker is attributing the outcome, losing the game or the project's failure to a specific cause, bad luck or lack of planning. Like many idiomatic expressions, chalk it up can have variations. Sometimes, people might say, chalk that up to, as in, chalk that up to experience. The meaning remains the same, but the structure is slightly altered for emphasis or fluidity in conversation. I hope this explanation helps you understand the phrase, chalk it up, better. Idioms like this are what make learning English so interesting and dynamic. Remember, when you come across a challenging situation or outcome, sometimes, it's just a matter of chalking it up to experience and moving forward. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next video where we'll explore more fascinating aspects of the English language.